tell me why we shouldn't kill you now. The Conclave is destroyed. Everyone who attended is dead. Except for you. You think I'm responsible? Explain this. I... can't. What do you mean, you can't? I don't know what that is. Or how it got there. You're lying! We need him, Cassandra. So what happens now? Do you remember what happened? How this began? I remember running. Things were chasing me, and then... a woman. A woman? She reached out to me, but then... <sighs> Go to the Ford camp, Liliana. I will take him to the rift. What did happen? It will be easier to show you. It's a massive rift into the world of demons that grows larger with each passing hour. It's not the only such rift, just the largest. All were caused by the explosion at the Conclave. An explosion can do that? This one did. Unless we act, the breach may grow until it swallows the world. Each time the breach expands, your mark spreads, and it is killing you. It may be the key to stopping this, but there isn't much time. You say it may be the key? To doing what? Closing the breach. Whether that's possible is something we shall discover shortly. It is our only chance, however, and yours. I understand. Then... I'll do what I can, whatever it takes. They have decided your guilt. They need it. The people of Haven mourn our most holy, divine Justinia, head of the Chantry. The Conclave was hers. It was a chance for peace between mages and Templars. She brought their leaders together. Now they are dead. We lash out like the sky, but we must think beyond ourselves. As she did. Until the breach is sealed. There will be a trial. I can promise no more. Come. It is not far. Where are you taking me? Your mark must be tested on something smaller than the breach.
pulses are coming faster now. The larger the breach grows, the more rifts appear, the more demons we face. How did I survive the blast? They said you stepped out of a rift, then fell unconscious. They say a woman was in the rift behind you. No one knows who she was. Everything farther in the valley was laid waste, including the Temple of Sacred Ashes. I suppose you'll see soon enough. It's over. Drop your weapons. Now! Do you really think I need a staff to be dangerous? Is that supposed to reassure me? I haven't used my magic on you yet. <sighs> You're right. You don't need a staff, but you should have one. I cannot protect you. I should remember you agreed to come willingly. Take these potions. Maker knows what we will face. Where are all your soldiers? At the forward camp, or fighting. We are on our own for now. We may gain the advantage.
We're getting close to the rift. You can hear the fighting. Who's fighting? You'll see soon. We must help them. It is yours. You mean this? Whatever magic opened the breach in the sky also placed that mark upon your hand. I theorized the mark might be able to close the rifts that have opened in the breach's wake. And it seems I was correct. Meaning it could also close the breach itself? Possibly. It seems you hold the key to our salvation. Good to know. Here I thought we'd be ass deep in demons forever. Varric Tethras, rogue, storyteller, and occasionally unwelcome tag along. That's a nice crossbow you have there. Ah, isn't she? Bianca and I have been through. You named your crossbow Bianca? Of course. And she'll be great company in the valley. Absolutely not. Your help is appreciated, Varric, but... Have you been in the valley lately, Seeker? Your soldiers aren't in control anymore. You need me. Ugh. My name is Solus, if there are to be introductions. I am pleased to see you still live. He means... I kept that mark from killing you while you slept. Then I owe you my thanks. Thank me if we manage to close the breach without killing you in the process. Cassandra, you should know. The magic involved here is unlike any I have seen. Your prisoner is a mage, but I find it difficult to imagine any mage having such power. Understood. We must get to the forward camp quickly. Well... Bianca's excited. This way, down the bank. The road ahead is blocked. We must move quickly. 